Hi guys, welcome back to the channel, I'm Ben and today I show you another solution to fix the black screen on Quest 2 stuck on the three flashing dots. When you connect the Quest 2 via cable or via AirLink to your PC and rather than starting the Rift Home, in your headset you see three flashing dots as if actually is loading the home, but instead can happen two cases. This black screen is stuck forever. Or or the headset goes back to the Oculus Home. So let's see how to fix it. I had this problem a few times and it's still not clear to me on what depends and each time I had to solve in different way. First time for example it was enough to change USB port making sure that the port was 3.0 or VR ready or with the SS symbol next to it and in case of connection with a laptop that the USB port were fully powered. Another time I solved the problem simply Simply by reassociating the quest with my PC and I already show in another video how to do it. To some user I suggested to use a self-powered USB hub or to use a PCI USB 3.0 card and the solution worked for them. For someone else it was necessary to install an older driver of the graphic card and so far this solution was the most successful. So I'd say that in 90% of the case if you have this problem try to install an older graphic card driver. And finally you may need to reinstall the Oculus client. So uninstall and install it again. Anyway since the informatic subject is a bit last time I had this problem none of these solutions fixed the problem so I had to improvise this time I played a bit with the various settings on the Oculus client by changing some functions deactivating and reactivating again restarting the client and it happened that by deactivating the beta channel and reactivating again everything started working again so how you do it open the client go to settings beta, deactivate the test channel, close the client and restart it. Now go settings, beta again and reactivate the test channel, close the client again and restart it once more. Now try to link again your Quest 2 to your PC via a link cable or via air link and the problem should be fixed. If when you go to the beta the channel is already deactivated, simply activate it and restart the client. I don't know if it was a coincidence. Computer science is a mysterious subject that can stop working on its own and then start to working again without you have to do nothing. So I don't know if this was actually the solution, but you have to tell me in the comments if it worked for you. Thank you for watching the video completely, like, share, subscribe and ring the bell. From Ben it's all, see you today next one and see you in VR. Bye guys.